Welcome for a special series called Shit I Didn't Know Was The Menopause, part one. Because I was diagnosed so young and during a time in the 90s where there was no social media, no one knew anything about my case, I was pretty much thrown into the world by myself to deal with the menopause. And over the years, I've had countless of symptoms, symptoms that still linger today and symptoms that thank God, knock on wood, will never ever return. I hope it stays that way. Today I wanted to talk about the symptoms that I've experienced over the years that I didn't even know were related to menopause. Even my doctors could not clue in that what was happening to me was connected to menopause. First symptom we're gonna talk about today, vaginal dryness. Yes, let's talk about our vaginas because you know what? It's important to talk about our vaginas. I was diagnosed when I was 14 and I was diagnosed before puberty. So I had to complete my gross birth before thinking about anything else that a premature menopause was gonna bring on into my life. And when I was 20 is when I became sexually active. And yes, 20 seems old to some people, but you know what? I was very self-conscious about my body in my teens with everything that happened to me. There was no way in hell I was gonna let any peepees come near me. Can't believe I just called it that. But anyways, when I was finally ready to, you know, do the dirty deed, I was so excited and I was so pumped to see what this whole thing was about. And man, was I ever disappointed. <laughs> because I was so young and menopausal at that time, I was very dry down there. Very, very, very dry due to the loss of estrogen that I was experiencing. They put me on birth control pill as HRT, which was not the proper HRT for my body at the time and for the nature of my diagnosis it was just not the right call for me so even though it was helping in some ways i was still having significant um symptoms including vaginal dryness but i didn't know that this was happening to me because of my premature menopause i thought it was normal i thought it was normal to feel the dryness to be in so much pain and so much discomfort to not enjoy it that this is only supposed to be for men to enjoy not women Women, and I was stupid enough not to bring it up to any of my friends to anybody I didn't ask any questions I just thought well I guess this is it it wasn't until I was 25 that I learned through my doctor at that time my new doctor at that time that this isn't normal and this isn't the way it's supposed to be and that woman saved my life she placed me on the proper HRT that I needed to be on, which was body identical hormones. I started on the estrogel and progesterone. Finally being on the proper HRT that I needed for my body when I turned 25 completely changed my life. Within six months, everything improved everything. Even my breasts grew even more than they were at the time. Like I felt like I had finally blossomed into the woman I was supposed to be. And a few years later, because I did begin to experience a little bit of vaginal dryness again, I was introduced to a magical pill called Vagifem and releases estrogen into your VJJ to help you keep things nice and moist. And this changed my SEX life forever. I was honestly on it for about a year or two and then I had to come off it because it did make my heart palpitate a little bit more than normal. I do have a heart um, issue, nothing serious, I'm okay, it's totally monitored, but I got scared and I stopped using it. And I don't know if it just, what it created down there, but ever since, I haven't had the need to use it. My patches are just perfect. Everything's nice and moist down there. I have not had any complications in my SEX life since, and I'm almost 40 and I'm going strong. But in the case that I was to experience the dryness again, which I really hope I can never do again. It's been years now, years, so I don't know. At least I know there's a backup option and there's other backup options. So just know if you are a young girl, you're experiencing dry, painful SEX, it is not normal. Get that shit checked out. There are options out there to help you with that. Don't put up with it. Don't be stupid like I was. There's help out there, okay? Do not let your doctor tell you there's nothing you can do about it because it is bullshit. There's something you can do about it. And now bring your ear closer to me. 
Come on, bring your ear closer to me. If your doctor's not listening to you, find another doctor. I don't care how nice he is or how nice she is or whatever, how many years she's been in your life. Your doctor's not listening to you and they don't wanna help you. Find another doctor. There is always gonna be another doctor that wants to fucking help you. I cannot emphasize that enough. End of my rant. So yeah. Vaginal dryness is very real and a very, very common menopausal symptom that is awful and not pleasant to deal with. But there's options out there. Remember that. There is help out there. Remember that. So that closes today's part one of shit I didn't know was a menopause.